guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are getting unready. We're taking our makeup off for a change. I have not done one of these videos in so, so long. I am so excited to say that this video is sponsored by Ulla Henriksen. If you guys have been keeping up to date with me on Instagram and on Instagram stories and through my other vlogs and stuff, you will know that I have a very exciting new skincare routine which has made enough difference that loads of you guys have been asking me for my skincare routine so I have been trialing out these products for such a long time now I am just super excited to show you something that has really 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 worked for me so the first product that you guys know that I've been using is the Ulla Henriksen Glow 2 Dark Spot Toner it looks like I've not used that much of it but a toner you use a tiny little amount every single night so that's what I've been doing with this I've been trialing it out and I have been getting unreal results but the first thing we need to do is take our makeup off. I'm going to take all my rings off, this is what I do. This is a dangerous thing that I do actually because I'm really forgetful, I'm surprised I've not lost anything yet. Roll my sleeves up, I take my hoops out and I'm going to take my hair out this class and I'm going to get it out my face. I am a new platinum blonde and I need to be really careful around my hairline so the first thing I'm going to do is put my hair up. I haven't used this yet but I'm really excited. This is just a microfiber headband by Kitsch and I've been using something like this for ages but this one is specifically for your ritual which I do every single night. I have to say skincare really works. You get the best results when you do it every single night so I've been really doing my ritual now for a long time. This little guy has a hole in it so I'm going to put my hair through the hole and that keeps it out my face and then I'm going to cover all my blonde up. Here we go. Take our lashes off. The best part of the day. See ya. And the cleanser I'm going to use is the Ulla Henriksen Wonder Feel Double Cleanser. I have been using this for a couple of weeks. Probably my latest addition to my Ulla skincare routine. It's great. It comes with a little cloth Look how prepared I am, you guys. I have a bowl of water. This is something I created earlier. I've got a bowl of warm water, and the first thing I'm going to do is get a little bit of this water and just pat it over my makeup. Perfect. My makeup's been on all day, so I'm ready to take it off. I'm going to get my Wonder Feel Cleanser, and I've got about this much in my hand. The way I work this is I rub it in the palms of my hand and straight onto my damp face, and we're going to massage this in. For one to two minutes, this guy is so good at getting your makeup off. It's not like one of those cleansers that makes your skin feel really, really tight and dry afterwards. It's really, really moisturising and it's a double cleanser, which means it's getting right in there, right in your skin. This is one of the only cleansers that I feel really actually gets my makeup off. It lifts everything. It has olive and barrage seed oils and blackcurrant extract in it as well. I actually have notes on my phone, but my hands are really, really dirty now. But all I'm going to do is massage this in, make sure I'm getting around the perimeter of my face with all the makeup and then underneath my chin as well. Sides of my nose. It smells really nice and light. I was reading on the website as well. My skin type is, I would say, really kind of combination, normal to combination. If you guys have followed me for a long time, you'll know that my skin hasn't always been great. Not that I've had acne or anything before, but I just used to get the same breakouts every single month, like on my forehead and my chin and stuff. And it's made me so happy to see that you guys have been seeing a difference in my skin as well. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the cloth that you get with the cleanser and we're going to dip it in this warm water. I'm also going to kind of wash my hands off a little bit in this water. And then I'm going to take this damp warm cloth and just remove the cleanser and any of my makeup. Oh, fresh. You can see all the eye makeup is off. The cleanser gets rid of all makeup waterproof and everything. So it's really good for getting mascara off. And I've found that whatever the formula is made of makes lash glue go really kind of goopy. So it's really easy to get off as well. And then I'm just taking the rinsed out cloth just around my hairline just to make sure that I've got rid of all the makeup. Making sure all my makeup's off my neck as well. Okay, now I am all cleansed. Look at this. Look at all that muck. It's off. It's off my face. The next product I'm going to talk about is probably the product that I have seen the biggest change in my skin and it is the toner. It's the Glow 2 Dark Spot Toner. I have already talked about this on my Instagram stories. I think I got sent this about three months ago to start trying out and I started using it every single night. You're meant to use it every night because it has AHAs which are acids and you are better to use them at night time because in the daytime you need to be using an SPF. So this toner, I started just using it every night and the way I do that is I get 
get my little cotton pads. I like the cotton pads that are kind of stitched around the sides so it doesn't all kind of flake off. Or I've been using cotton pads like these, which are the kind of square pads, which I just get on Amazon. But I'm gonna use one of the little square ones today to show you. I just scoosh a little bit on to my cotton pad and then I just take the toner and pop it all over. It's got the Ulla Henriksen signature scent, which I didn't know what it was. I just think it smells absolutely unbelievable. And then I read on their website that it smells like lemonade and it totally does smell like lemonade, but it is the most beautiful smell. It's really uplifting and fresh. And this toner, even though it's got the acids in it, it is suitable for everyday use. It's got chamomile in it and sandalwood, which is nice and calming on the skin. Like I said, it's got the beautiful smell and it is a dark spot toner, which means what it's gonna do is, I don't know if you guys remember, but I used to have a fair bit of scarring up here. It's still not completely gone away, but I've got a fair bit of scarring up here and then around my chin used to be really bad as well. And this stuff, I don't know how it does it. It's just totally smoothed out all my skin tone, evened me right out. When you put it on, you feel a slight tingle. It's a wee bit like, oh, I wouldn't say it's sore at all. There's some skincare products I've used before, which is, it's been so stingy that I thought I was having like a reaction or something. It's nothing like that. It's a really soft, gentle tingle. Not only does it work on your dark spots, but it also works on your fine lines and wrinkles. And for me, the biggest difference that I have seen is the texture of my skin looks so smooth now. Like before I had kind of bumpy skin on my forehead. I used to get bumps around my chin as well. And now I feel like it's just super smooth. And the way that I kind of noticed that the most was when I was putting my makeup on the next day. The makeup would just literally glide on and my highlight looked better, powder sat better on my skin. I just think that it's pretty magical and a toner is something that I never really used to use wholeheartedly like I didn't think it made a huge difference it does all those things that I've just said and it preps your skin perfectly for your serum and your moisturiser so cleansers are great I do like a good cleanser it's good to get my makeup off but the things that are making the most difference for me at the moment are the toner and the serum the next thing that I'm going to talk about is the serum so the serum that I use is the Glow Cycle Retin Alt Power Serum and this has the same AHAs and they've got something in it called Bacuchiol which is an alternative to retinol and I don't really know exactly what that means because I'm not a skincare expert but basically retinol just helps your skin process quicker, it helps the cell turnover quicker as well, it's the only thing that stimulates collagen in the skin so it's really really good for people especially my age, I'm 25 so this is when I should be using my anti-aging but it's also good for people that think that they're too late because retinols work on every single age group which is amazing. I actually use this at night time. You can use it during the day as well, but I'll show you. It's got a lavender color, which is really good for brightening the skin. I'm sure you guys have seen that you can get like makeup primers and stuff that have lavender in them. And I like putting this on my skin at night time first before my moisturizer. And like I said, this is just a kind of plant derived alternative to retinol. There's some really, really good videos on YouTube actually to tell you all about retinol. But I have tried retinol and this is the product that I have been using. And I've actually been using this for six months. The person that first gave me a bottle of this was actually Karen. I love Sarai. She had loads of them in her house and she gave me one. She was like, you need to try this. So I've been using this for absolutely ages and I've been trying it out. I'm super excited by the results. Like, I just think my skin looks so much glowier than it used to and so much smoother. And like I said, the reason that I realized that things were really working for me was because you guys were telling me all the time. You were saying that my skin looked great. Drop that skincare routine right now, please. Here it is, guys, here it is. The last step in my nighttime routine is the Goodnight Glow Retinol Sleeping Cream. This is pretty much the same. These guys are all together. They're all blue, you can see. And this is just a really nice moisturizer with the same benefits of the toner and the serum, but basically we've just layered it. Same gorgeous lavender color. And what I'm gonna do is just rub that in my hands and press it on. And this is just a really gorgeous night cream. It leaves my skin looking super dewy and fresh. It smells brilliant. All this stuff smells so, so, so good. And because we've layered them all up, you're gonna get the most benefits from your product. They're gonna work the best that they can. And I've just looked it up on the website to make sure I've hit all the points and I have missed that there is an Edelweiss stem cell which helps firm and improve elasticity through the night. So it's really, really hydrating and in the morning, your skin just feels so much more kind of full of bounce and juiciness, the dream. 
So now we've got all our skincare products on, you can also pop these down your neck as well. I am going to finish off with my eye cream. So the eye cream that I've been using is, this is probably the first product that I ever saw of Uli Henriksen because of how viral it went. It was just super spoken about online. This is the Ulla Henriksen Banana Bright Eye Cream. It has your vitamin C in there. It's also got banana powder, which is brightening, so you kind of see instant results with this. I did use eye cream and I really tried to, but it was one of those things that I would forget to use and not anymore because I'm terrified. I can see the change in my eyelids happening already, guys. Things are changing in my body. <laughs> so I'm being really, really good with my eye cream and I just put this on all over my lid. It's also said to be a really really good eye primer and actually I've been using this underneath my makeup and it doesn't affect my shadows in any way other than they look good. I use my eye primer on top still anyway and I just pat this in all over my eye, over the brow, ta-da, flawless. I'm going to take my hair out this crazy thing so it looks stupid. <laughs> that is me done my full routine for night time. I'm just going to tell you about one more product that I've been using religiously. This is the Ulla Henriksen Sea Rush Brightening Gel Cream. The most stunning daytime moisturiser. I really love this. It smells absolutely amazing. It's the same smell. Oh my god. And because it's a gel cream, it feels a lot lighter on the skin than a normal kind of cream moisturiser would. So it's really good for me wearing makeup every day. The vitamin C in it keeps your skin looking super fresh and alive. It makes your skin look so much brighter than when I don't use it. I can totally tell the difference. This has been tried and tested by me. This is my old pot. It's absolutely done. So I just opened a fresh one as a treat to myself. So I've already finished one of these moisturisers and I've actually already finished one of the serums as well. This is in my graveyard drawer. Finidal, see ya. I'm just going to quickly zoom you guys in to have a good look at my skin close up so you can see the difference. I always get little marks here whenever I take my makeup off so ignore them, they go away within like 20 minutes. This is my skin with absolutely no makeup on. I've just got my skincare on. The makeup remover, as you can see, has completely removed all my eye makeup. I've not had to use anything else to get that off, which is really great for me. Also, should have mentioned that the cleanser is so gentle around your eye area. But this is my skin. I'm so happy with it. Really, really happy. I'm most excited about the texture of my forehead. If you guys remember, I had a really bad breakout up here because of a foundation. And it almost gave me kind of pocket scars in my forehead a little bit. And they are just so much more smoothed out. You can see my chin is a lot clearer. I used to get tons of blemishes around here. I literally have kind of no spots which is great. And it's not just like I'm filming this on a good day. My skin has been consistently like this now for at least like the last four to six weeks. So I am pretty thrilled. So you guys, that is my skincare routine as of late. I am going to just insert a picture right here of what my skin was looking like. Just to show you that my skin was almost just irritated, constantly irritated. I didn't have anything to soothe it. I know that it was really congested. I wasn't exfoliating properly. I wasn't using any kind of retinols or anything like that or acids. So this is what my skin was like and this is what it's like now. So I am really, really thrilled. The main thing for me is making sure that I do these things every single day and I know sometimes it's hard and you're tired but if you give yourself that 10 minutes just to pamper your ritual it is so good for your skin but it's also really really good for you just for a little bit of self-care it makes me feel really really great when I go to bed my face smells like a glass of lemonade so I really hope that you guys enjoyed this little skincare routine I am gonna keep active on my Instagram stories with how I'm getting on using all these things these guys really have been the change the game type products for me so I've been really really excited to share them with you as always I'll link everything that I've used down below and other than that I will see you in the next video Bye! Oh, isn't that pretty with my ears out? It's adorable. Ching! Wow, I look so flippin' ugly right now. <laughs> I look so crazy. Around about that, about, around, and do you know what's it? No, bleh. drop that skin to So, I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial. No, it's not really a tutorial, is it? Stem style. Oh my god, why can't I talk to you? There's an Idleweiss stem stale. Stale? There's an Idleweiss stem. Oh my god.